Hey guys, this is your friend Iggy back again with Dragon Blogger. So I was just about done writing the review for the Sapphire Radeon Nitro RX470 OC 4 gig card. And while I was about to paste some uh, screenshots of the fan check utility going through its paces, I couldn't find them. I don't know what to do with them. So I figured out, let me just go run it again. And while it did, turns out these fans had an error. And well, so I went online and I registered, I did all that stuff for a fan replacement. You could do that online, I'll show you in the review also. Now, just to state, this was not the first destination for this card to be reviewed, this specific card. It's gone through its paces through a bunch of other reviewers. I'm rough on the card, I don't know how rough they were on the card, so Again, it's been through its paces, so, you know, things like this do happen. They go through a bunch of people's hands. So, anyway, so I'm going to show you guys, now that I have the fans, all right, I got them. I received them from Sapphire. It's actually, they sent two fans just in case. So, I received the fans from Sapphire, again, after registering them, and I found there is no real video on how to replace them so i'm going to show you guys real quick here how to do it so come over here real quick all right so here's the card you all know and love all right at first since again there is no video i thought i'd have to undo all these screws to take this entire thing off to get to these fans actually looking a little closer there's an easier way so if you can see right here there's a little screw so you take that screw off and you just lift these guys out. So let me show you real quick how to do that. All right. Just get your screwdriver. Be sure you don't strip those screws. You got to put them back on. All right. And that's where it helps to have a magnetic tip screwdriver. Just put it aside again for right now since you will need it. And that's it. You lift a little tiny bit and you slide out. You can see here, it kind of looks like a little SD card. See right here? You just lift it. All right, and now I'm gonna show you how to put one back in. It comes in a little container like this. It has my address on the other side, so I'm not gonna flip it over. And then you can just open it up. And then you have two fans. Or maybe you might just have one, but either way, let me open that up and take that fan out. All right, comes just like that. Again, don't lose this little guy. There is no screw in this package. So just open it up. Take it out. And now you're just literally gonna slide that guy right into here, okay? And again, I've never done this before, so it shouldn't be that difficult. It should kind of just, yeah, I don't know if you saw that. Let me try to put that a little bit better. Okay, so you can see, holding it in a way so that you can see that little connector right here, okay? And that's going to go right into here and it's going to kind of slide into there so you can see that here all right so you can see it all right there you go now i'm going to slide it down in there and it's going to slide in place and let's see and then that screw hole is visible so now all you gotta do, screw it in place, that's it. You've just replaced the fan on the Sapphire Radeon Nitro RX470 card. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do this one on my own and I'll take some pictures, that way, you know, I'll put that in the review as well. And well, that's about it for now. Again, this is a video just showing you guys how to replace the 
quick change fans on the Sapphire Radeon Nitro OC RX 470 card. Iggy with Dragon Blogger out. See you guys.